If you got into crypto, it's probably for reasons like this. Tons of people are showing how they turned hundreds of dollars into millions over the last three months. Now, I know what you're thinking. They probably bought Bitcoin at $4 or Ethereum at $5. And well, the surprising answer is no. In fact, this was all done by trading meme coins with names like Dog with Hat, Book of Meme, Cat with Fade, Bonk, and a whole load of other weird coins that you would not believe could make you a multi-millionaire overnight. So in today's video, we are covering how to find the next great meme coins, how to do so safely, as well as giving you my top six picks that I believe will skyrocket over the coming months. Also, the further I go with my list, the riskier the rewards become, so you're going to want to stay and watch right up until the end. Now, I want to put a quick disclaimer that meme coins, whilst they are tools of investment, they do not follow traditional patterns such as other more reliable projects do. These are based purely off of hype, and as quickly as they can make you rich, they can also very quickly go to zero. But, as my late Uncle Ben always said, with great meme coins comes great responsibility. So with that out of the way, let's get you started on the craziest investments you are ever likely to make. In the last bull cycle, we had some famous meme coins leading the way, with the top ones being Doge, Shiba Inu, and Pepe. Well, this time around, the Solana blockchain seems to be the home of all things meme coins. Now, the reason for this is because of the very low gas fees, allowing users to buy and sell tokens effortlessly. This has given birth to dozens of new projects, skyrocketing them from $0 to around $3 billion in market cap almost overnight. Now, if you're looking to trade meme coins, then you'll have to get in early by making use of decentralized exchanges. Now, this may seem daunting at first, but it doesn't have to be. You see, there are different tiers to exchanges, and the earlier you are at finding a coin, the less likely it is to have been listed on a larger exchange, such as Binance or Coinbase. These would be considered tier 1 exchanges as they are the most commercial platforms. You then get tier 2 exchanges, such as Mex Global, Bybit, or KuCoin. These exchanges are more likely to list smaller projects just as they are gaining momentum. The decentralized exchanges, however, are where you want to be playing around in. This is how you'll be able to find meme coins with tiny market caps that are yet to be listed. Because once they do become listed, those tokens will go through the roof, giving you that 400x you dream of. Think of it like investing in a company whilst they're still working out of their mom's garage. You could be sitting on a gold mine or your investment could completely tank. Which is why it's so important to do your own research and only invest what you can afford to lose. When it comes to Solana, the leading DEXs are Jupiter, Radium, and Orca. Here you will have access to a whole bunch of low-cap altcoins. We're talking about projects with market caps that are well below $50 million, with some even in the hundreds of thousands. Like I said, it's risky, but that's what we're here for. Now, before we get to trading meme coins, the main thing that you want to look out for is safety. And I've come up with four things that you need to look out for before investing. The first is the amount of holders the token has. If a large portion of the newly minted token is held by only one or two whales, then that might be a potential risk as they could dump the token, sending the price crashing. The liquidity provided should always be relatively high compared to the token's market cap. This way, you'll have somewhat of a guarantee that you could withdraw your funds at any given time. The contract being renounced is probably the most important point as it ensures that the token devs cannot make changes to the contract such as disabling sales, changing fees, as well as minting or transferring tokens. Social media accounts are very important because 99% of meme coins run off of hype. And if you don't have a flourishing community, then it's pretty hard to create any excitement around the token. And if they do have all of those things, then make sure that they are posting every single day because you are going to want to get everybody aboard the hype train. We kick things off with our very first pick, which is Wolf with Balls. Now, this meme coin is riding the coattails of Dog with Hat, and it just so happens to have a raging community that seems to be making all the right noises. With a market cap of just under $10 million, the meme coin has already had two pumps with a high of 81 cents. It has since had a big correction as the market topped out and cooled off a bit, providing some great entry points for new buyers. Now, this is a common trend with meme coins because whenever you have one meme coin leading the way, you will often have others being created with the same likeness and riding the hype. This can lead to more people supporting it because of its likeness to dog with hat, as well as the community just looking out for one another. Now, I want to show you something that happened while I was filming this video, and this is an example of what I just explained except with cat meme coins trading in unison. 
These are all on Solana and almost every cat token was pumping all at the same time. Almost $50 million in trading volume over 24 hours, which is just absolutely insane. Narratives of the driving force behind all things meme coins and the ability to plug the word balls into just about any conversation is one of the main reasons why I believe Wolf of Balls will be a mainstay in the world of internet culture, no matter how hard it gets. That's what she said. <laughs> With the following of just under 20,000 people over on X and some healthy price action, Wolf with Ball seems like a pretty good bet during this bull run. So if you've got the balls to put your bag on the line, then Wolf with it might be the one. Now I know some of you might not like this, but Dolan Trump may just be the most surefire meme coin on this list. Here's why. If you're not aware, Donald Trump is running for president again at the end of this year, and the closer we get to election time, the more likely people are to ape into meme coins or ones just like this. Now, Dolan Trump already has a decent market cap size of $39 million, but it might have some way to go given that the elections are still seven months away. Since being launched, it has topped off with an all-time high of $0.81 cents before cooling off with the rest of the market. Now, I do suspect this meme coin to top off at the end of the election cycle, or if he does win, then perhaps around inauguration time. Now, this doesn't only work for Donald Trump coins. These could be for any other political figures that you can find meme coins on. Perhaps Geo Biden, Justin Trudeau, or even Kamala Horace might be what you're looking for. Whatever you do, just make sure that you are ready to cash out or take profits along the way before the election process is concluded. With a slogan like Make Memes Great Again, it's kind of tough to see how you could do anything other than We're gonna win so much, you may even get tired of winning! Guacamole is one of the more interesting projects that I've come across in the meme coin space because it offers a whole lot more than just an image of guac. Guacamole provides a fresh take on the way we interact and engage with digital economies. It's a playful platform built on the Solana blockchain, offering easy-to-use trading platforms, simple tools for developers, and fun game-like features that enhance your experience. Guacamole is making the complex world of Web3 more easily digestible and accessible to everyone with a focus on integrated discoverability networks and marketplace solutions. Basically, they are simplifying the backend of Web3 development for newcomers. What initially started out as a meme coin has blossomed into a well-thought-out project. Now, the token's price action is probably the healthiest out of all the coins on this list, and it could very quickly reach its all-time high over the coming months. With a market cap of just $29 million, Guacamole is a meme coin with utility that seems to be in a league of its own. Now the team does have some lofty goals for the project and with the first wave of layer 2 listings still to come and multiple projects migrating to web 3, I would not be surprised to see Guacamole do anywhere between a 10 to 20x this bull cycle given the amazing fundamentals behind it. Also, who doesn't like Guacamole? Launched on the 4th of March on the Mantle Network, we have Puff the Magic Dragon. Unlike other meme coins, Puff is a novel meme coin that has a storyline attached to it. This means that Puff's storyline is only just beginning as holders will be able to interact and influence the direction of the dragon's storyline. The idea of attaching a narrative to a meme coin is something that I like as I feel it adds a layer of trust between the developers and the holders. Now the team is looking to reward token holders which will come in the form of a 5 part airdrop. This is divided up into 6 different chapters over the coming 3 months. Here token holders will be able to earn more puff tokens depending on which storyline they choose. Now at the time of me scripting this video, puff actually tripled in price, going from 10 cents to 30 cents before cooling off a bit. Now my assumption is that puff the magic dragon could reach a couple hundred million dollars in market cap over the coming months as the team looks to phase in the narrative behind the token. Now I think this is one project to watch because everything about it screams that there's a game on the way or some form of content creation behind it. But that's just my assumption because where there's a dragon, there's smoke. And where there's smoke, there's fire. If you made it this far in the video, then make sure to smash that subscribe button as I bring you weekly crypto content. Also, if you would like 30% discount on your trading fees every time you buy cryptocurrency, as well as standing the chance to win a bunch of other prizes, you can do so by using my Bybit affiliate link in the description below. I'd really appreciate it. My favorite pick is Poncho. It's a cat wearing a poncho. Now the website looks really cool and it gives you a breakdown of the tokenomics involved, which has all the makings of a long-term project. Sitting at a market cap of just under $3 million, Poncho seems like a riskier play for the time being, but what is meme coins without a bit of risk? 
Now, Poncho also has a roadmap, or as they call it, Poncho's plan, that details what the project is looking to achieve over the coming year. This includes listings on both Tier 1 and Tier 2 exchanges, as well as some base partnerships and an NFT launch later on. They do have a pretty decent following over on X and Telegram, so make sure to give them a follow and check it out. Now, Poncho, I think, could do really well over the coming months, as it has the potential to do a 50x or beyond, given its tiny market cap. With its cuteness and transparency looking to take it to the top, Poncho may be the base network's cutest meme coin of the year. Keeping in line with the base network is Basenji, the world's oldest dog breed. Now, if you're from Africa, you must have come across one of these dogs by now because they're just everywhere. While the Basenji token is no different, heralded as the father of all dog coins, Basenji is looking to do exactly that. Now this for me stands out as a great long-term play if you're willing to stick around for this bull cycle and beyond. With the Basenji token potentially being the face of the base network, this token could give you a 50x over the coming year. So far since its release, it has had some healthy price action while still having a tiny market cap of around $25 million. Now, Basenji seems primed for a breakout of some sort, just given the moderate action that's taken place since its launch. And I have a sneaky feeling that this token is going to surprise a lot of people. Basenji does have a great website where they explain the history of the dog, taking you back to the ancient times when it was first discovered. Here they give you a full breakdown of what the tokenomics are like, where you can follow them on social media, as well as how you can buy Basenji tokens by walking you through it step by step. Now I have to say that I in no way endorse the purchase of these tokens, nor am I sponsored by any of them. I just really like looking at meme coins that could potentially make me a lot of money. Now, Base in particular is a chain that has a lot of room to grow, especially with Coinbase able to onboard any of these tokens to their 90 plus million users. It's very easy to see how any of these base meme coins could become the next Dogecoin or Shiba Inu over the coming year. The road to base competing with Solana and Ethereum in meme cap market size is going to make quite a few new millionaires. And when it does, I hope to see you at the top.